good morning all of you today we will be discussing about division of integers so multiplication of integers we have already discussed now let's see the division division is similar to multiplication itself in the case of sign or if it's negative or positive or plus sign minus sign all those things are similar to multiplication so first let's see the division of integers the division of negative integer by a positive integer okay that is negative integer 12 divided by positive integer 2 okay so how will you find the answer for this thing division means what here you are going to divide 12 by 2 that means that means you need to find the number by which when multiplied with 2 we will get the answer as minus 12 that is the meaning of division that is 2 into something when you do you will get the answer as what minus 12 okay that is the meaning of this division understand so 2 into dash equal to minus 12 this thing you have to find and this will be the quotient for this question okay so you have already studied about the multiplication of integers so you will understand that 2 into what will be minus 12 you will see that 2 into minus 6 equal to minus 12 is it 2 into minus 6 equal to minus 12 so you can say that the answer for this will be minus 6 that is minus 12 divided by 2 equal to minus 6 similarly for this one how will you find it that is you know that you need to find the answer for this one so what will you do that is 7 into something equal to minus 14 this is actually the multiplication statement for this division okay so you will get one thing here and that will be the answer for this question okay in this way you are doing the division so 7 into what is minus 14 you know that 7 into 2 is 14 but in order to get minus 14 you should put a negative sign here minus sign here okay so the answer for this will be minus 2 okay so from this answers you will understand one thing what is that whenever we divide a negative integer by a positive integer we will get the answer as a negative integer okay that is when we divide a negative integer by a positive integer what you should do you should first divide them as whole and put the negative sign before the quotient that is here minus 12 divided by 2 means what you have to divide 12 by 2 then you will get 6 as the answer and then you need to put the negative sign similarly for the second question first you have to divide 14 by 7 and then you have to put the negative sign then you will get minus 2 okay now let's see this one that is here we are dividing a positive integer by a negative integer in the previous case it was division of a negative integer by a positive integer but here we are dividing a positive integer by a negative integer so let's see what will be the answer so for the first question 16 divided by minus 8 equal to dash that is minus 8 when multiplied by something you will get in the answer as 16 and you have to find out this one okay so 8 into 2 is actually 16 but in the answer we have got a positive integer in the answer and we know that multiplication of a negative integer with a negative integer will give what positive integer as the answer so in the answer we should write minus 2 okay not just 2 if you write 2 here means what in the answer you should get minus 16 but here it is 16 so answer will be minus 2 okay now let's see the next one next one is 
56 divided by minus 7 that means what minus 7 when multiplied by something we will get in the answer as 56 that means what you know that 7 into 8 is 56 but you see this minus 7 into 8 what will be the answer the answer will be minus 56 but in the answer we have plus 56 that means what this should be minus okay this 8 should be minus 8 okay then only we will get the product as 56 okay because multiplication of a negative integer with a negative integer will give positive integer okay so in the answer we will get what minus 8 okay so from here also you will understand that when you divide a positive integer by a negative integer in the answer you will get what a negative integer itself and when we divide a positive integer by a negative integer you need to just divide them as whole and put the negative sign before the quotient okay here you have to do 16 divided by 8 then you will get 2 then you have to put the negative sign here also 56 by 7 you will get 8 and you have to put the negative sign okay so this is the case for division of positive integer by a negative integer and negative integer by a positive integer now let's see what happens when we divide a negative integer by a negative integer so for the first case that is minus 12 divided by minus 2 what you have to find minus 2 into something equal to minus 12 okay so you know that 2 into 6 is what minus 2 into 6 is 12 but in the answer and also in the answer we have got minus 12 so here also minus 12 that means what here we should put 6 okay similarly for the second one also you can see that minus 5 into something equal to what minus 25 okay that means in the answer you are getting a negative number okay for getting a negative number you should multiply a positive with a negative number that means what here it should be a positive number okay so it will be 5 into 5 is 25 so you can write only 5 here no need of writing minus 5 okay so the answer for this will be 5 okay in this way you can divide numbers by using the multiplication table you will divide the numbers is it so this is the answer for this one and this is the answer for this one that means what whenever you divide a negative integer by a negative integer then in the answer you will get a positive integer okay that is here minus 12 divided by minus 2 equal to 6 similarly minus 25 divided by minus 5 equal to 5 that means you have to divide them as whole and put the positive sign okay this was the same case for multiplication also that is whenever you multiply integers having the same sign then in the answer you will get positive integers is it similarly whenever you multiply a positive integer with a negative integer or a negative integer with a positive integer then in the answer you will get a negative integer similarly here also for division whenever you divide a negative integer by a positive integer or a positive integer by a negative integer then in the answer you will get what a negative integer similarly whenever you divide a negative by a negative integer then in the answer you will get a positive integer okay that's the only thing you have to keep in mind so now let's conclude this for any two integers a and b a a divided by minus b equal to what minus a divided by b okay that is minus can be taken anywhere a divided by minus b equal to minus a divided by b okay and this will be equal to what a divided by b and you have to put the negative sign okay so this is the case of division for 
division of a negative by a positive or positive by a negative okay now minus a divided by minus b means what both are negative means what in the answer you will get what a divided by b okay in the answer you will get a divided by b this is the case for division of two negative integers that is division of a negative integer by a negative integer okay in both the cases b must not be equal to zero okay because if b is equal to zero means what division will not be possible that is if 5 5 divided by 0 this is not possible okay so we should say b not equal to 0 that is a must condition okay so this is the case for what division of integers understand so that's all about the division of integers thank you